<laughs> really like the new studio. I thought you would have got rid of some of the old furniture. You're pointing to mud flap. <laughs> wow. <laughs> no, 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 man. I'm a staple. That's my coworker I'm right a, there, that's baby. That's my coworker, baby. <laughs> Woo! All Come right. here and give me a hug. <laughs> Maybe later. <laughs> <laughs> How was the bacon in the green room? Was it cooked? To really your, good. Love the green M and M's with it. Okay. Excellent yeah. job today, guys. Right. Okay, good. Okay. Well, like I said, you just uh, if there's an update on your list of requirements, you send that next week. No, yeah. I think we'll that's, have that'll you. that'll do. Okay. All right. I, I don't right. want to go over the top. Okay. All right. But if well, you offer, I'll think about okay. it. Well, no, hey, appreciate and your did big you, have you been noticing like over the weekend? Whenever I, you know, I'm on Saturday, I'm like, and I get done with the weather, I go. And now, here's my buddy, Pete Christie, with the sports. Yeah, I guess we're buddies, because if yeah. not, I would have to sue you, but that's true. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> so, yeah. I get the uh, feeling that Pete's a, you're, you're, well, never mind. I, I think Pete likes you. Okay. Yeah. Oh, I love no. Mudflap. Okay. I love the new studio, too. This is fantastic. <laughs> what do you love more, Mudflap or the new studio? I like <laughs> I like the smell. I got the new studio smell in Me? here. Me? I don't smell any different. <laughs> no, you smell very different than most people. Okay. Uh, no, uh, Pete Chrissy from News Channel 11, and we're back with, uh, well, first of all, day 11 o'clock on Rock 101.1. We're back with the Red Raider outfit of Rock and Pregame. So, uh, Pete, I'll be looking forward to yeah, uh, getting that rolling again. Football. Yeah, That's going to be fun. Our buddy Jared and Sean will be there. It'll be a lot of fun. Um and then, um, let's see, what else? Did you hear, I guess, uh, Red Raider Outfitter is now the uh, merchandise provider at all the venues for Texas Tech. Tech announced that yesterday, so uh, Red Raider Outfitter, uh, that's a big, Man, big that's thing. Big. They're a big sponsor on our pregame show. Awesome, fact, yeah. too, So that was really awesome. cool, so we're proud of them. Um, so, Pete, the first thing, let's talk some high school football because it is back, and I know there are games. Now, was this is this the first week of the games? Or of Texas. Games? Last year. Okay. You know, KCBD now is in New Mexico in That's a few right, towns. Yeah. So we did a New Mexico show last week. They start a week early. But yeah. last night, I mean, there are like 13 or 14 games. So we were all oh. over. And tonight, uh, we'll be you know, 30 to 35. So. Dang. All right. So you got any uh, recap of any of the action last night? Here? Yeah. In town, Estacado beat Midland Greenwood 65 to 51. The new kids on the block. Not the new kids on the block. The, oh, the music not, group. Not uh, hanging tough. <laughs> yeah. Okay, not them. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> the right Please stuff. Don't go, girl. Oh, that's that. a good okay. one, too. Yeah, thank I you, can't yeah. think of another one, but that's good. <laughs> I, <laughs> I want it that way. Tell me why. <laughs> Isn't that in sync? <laughs> that's Backstreet Boys. Oh, Backstreet it, Boys, yeah. I don't know. Come on, man. <laughs> <That's>, <laughs> Come on, man. <laughs> I'm your buddy, dude. Back me up. All right. Um, anyway, we'll have more boy band music coming up. Yes. The new kids on the block, uh, Lubbock, Cooper, Liberty. Okay, yeah. The Patriots. They're out there on Woodrow Road between Slide and Quaker. Only freshman and sophomore this year. Okay. I understand they have two kids who can drive. So, you know, parents are dropping kids off. There aren't a bunch of cars in the parking oh, lot. Wow, okay. So they're playing a JV schedule. Okay. But all the other sports, varsity. And so this year they're in like 3A with Brownfield and Denver City. Next year they add juniors. That'll probably bump them up to the Leveland status, 4A. And then the next year they Who add is seniors. This? this is Lubbock Lubbock Cooper. Cooper. Are you now listening to the what Cooper I say? Cooper High School. Oh, the Cooper. Lubbock okay. Cooper Liberty. Listen, I'm a the little behind. <laughs> the no, new you're school. You're a big behind. <laughs> <laughs> and then when they have seniors, they'll probably be in district with Lubbock Cooper. Who knows? Wow. But they played their first ever game last night, and Lubbock Cooper Liberty. Beat Lubbock High, JV, 54-26. They got a lot of great coaches on that yeah, staff. Super oh, wow. excited for it. That's interesting yeah. to – because, you know, I wonder what effect so, – because that basically splits yeah. the amount of right. freshmen now that are they're going to be going out and for so football. And so the numbers are lower for Cooper, Lubbock yeah. Cooper, they told me. Yeah, yeah. that's interesting. Now that's Cooper, right? Right. It, yeah, yeah, I just checked. Yes. In, yeah. in friendship – there, aren't they building another high school at some point? Yeah, now we're talking about friendship. 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 Yeah. friendship. Yeah. But it's that same thing. That's what you know? we have, friendship. <laughs> you can split your schools, and then you might have to drop down in classification. You start kind of watering things down. But you, but the growth in that area for both friendship and Cooper has been so – Yes, I mean, you gotta, and you for ropes like and new yeah. home. It's oh, yeah. unbelievable. Right, unbelievable. yeah, ropes is, is definitely one of the next growing – I mean, it's kind of like, you know, I remember back in the day when, when Friendship was just the little country school yeah. out there around Wolf Earth. And, you know, so, I mean, really the growth out that direction, because Ropes will probably be kind of the next uh, 
friendship, I, I would think, you know. Yeah, I mean, the the, some is. of these so, towns yeah. are really Gosh, growing. Yeah. So, wow. All right, but anyway, back And then football. most of the other games were six-man. We got uh, Anton, who just got a new coach a week ago with Brian Duncan, former Red Raider. Uh, they lost to Booker 38-12. to Loop beat Christ the King 51-31. Jayton beat number 10 Garden City 68-20. And uh, number one two-time defending state champion Westbrook uh, lost to Knox City last night to open the season. So that happened out in Jayton, and we were out there. If you love six-man, you got to be out in Jayton this weekend. Tonight and tomorrow, a game started four today out in Jayton. Oh, six-man football is awesome, too. So um, tonight, then, what do we got? Friday Night Lights? Oh, yeah. I know, I know the big one. What's that one? Friendship and Coronado. Yeah, I would say that is the big one. I Thank mean, you. friendship's the biggest. Thank you. Yeah. Thank you. And we're talking about friendship? Yes, okay. Fred, not Cooper. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I don't want to steal your thunder, Pete. You go ahead. You just you take over. Oh, we're talking about weather yeah. now? Yeah, no, okay. no. No, no, no. You you got it. I'm unless, you, up, unless you want to do well. Yeah, you TV people I'm, are starting to wear me out. Here. I'm picking up now. what you're putting down. <laughs> yeah. So tonight we got uh, Odessa in town taking on Monterey. Um, just, I mean, a lot of games. You got the War on 84. Littlefield is at Mule Shoe tonight. Oh, yeah. Big Borden game. County Kingdom Prep, 4 o'clock at Jayton. Rawls at Floyd Data. I mean, it just goes that's, on and on good, and on. That's a pretty good rivalry, too. Isn't yeah, it? yeah. So there, just, though, yeah. you know, a lot of good games. To, and they know an interesting one. West Texas Stinnett is at Hale Center. West Texas Stinnett's head coach, Jeff Smith, was the head coach at Hale Center last year. Ah, okay. So he made the schedule. So he knew he was, I mean, he didn't know, but he made the schedule to play himself. Again, you know mm, what I mean? Okay, so he's yeah, playing yeah. his he's back in Hale Center tonight to play his former team. That's so interesting. probably be a lot of emotion in that game, I would think. Yeah, yeah with that kind of situation. And, and yeah. Snyder's at at Slayton and just big night, big night. I mean, I'm uh I'm on fumes, but I love it. Love it all. Love all these schools. Well, we're we're happy that football is back. Yes. And uh I guess tonight yeah. then the end zone, that's yeah, back name as of the well. show. Okay, yeah. Twentieth yeah. year in a row now for twentieth year. So all the highlights, yeah. scores. Yeah. What time? Ten to thirty. About ten fifteen. Okay. It's after Abner and Karen or do they work on Fridays or they have yeah. Fridays off? Okay. Yeah, they're not that's school has a four day week and some of these schools not work. Well, I thought Abner and Karen, I mean, at the level of status that they are as local celebrities, I thought maybe they were Well, I'll look into it. Like if they three, get four days off, days I'd love to get Mondays yeah, off well, and yeah. have four days, too. Well, yeah, you, you deserve tell it, Pete. I'm going to look into that. You're huge in this town. I think you deserve it. I, I, would, I would go in there and make that demand. I know. I'd rather work. <laughs> set. I mean, I love working. I do. I know. You do. You probably love work more than anybody I know, and I mean that well, sincerely. Yeah, I do. Me. Pete, you probably <laughs> love work more than anybody I know. <laughs> you like showing up. I don't know if you like work. Ah, you're probably right. Yeah, so it's you know, it's yeah, different. Good but, point. Uh, no, you do like to work. He, he really is. He does work quite yeah, a bit. I mean, I've seen him work. Yeah. He's, he's no, got a know. good work ethic. 